We named our wines Poland and Poland after the first of our ancestors to arrive to Australia from Northern Ireland in 1860 who established Poland Poland General Store. Subsequently, we named all of the wines after various incidents that occurred throughout their, through their trip to Australia. We've got the Limavady Shiraz, an area from which they're from in Northern Ireland. We then have the Tudor Chardonnay. The Tudor was the name of the ship that the wine was named after. We have John Rook, and John Rook was the father-in-law of the, Peter Poland, the first ancestor to arrive in Australia, and he was a convict, and he got sent over uh, as, a, as a criminal punishment to this beautiful country. And he went on to become a very successful businessman in Australia in his own right. Peter Poland, as I referenced, married his daughter, so that's sort of interluded to the convicts and Catholics range, which is our, our broader range, which includes our Chardonnay, Shiraz and Vidello. My main role is to take the wine to market. We're not a big company, we're a boutique producer of wine. So we like to work with uh, independent, smaller businesses, bars, restaurants, boutique bottle shops, uh, that sort of thing. Working with wine is really enjoyable. At the end of the day, we're uh, making the world a happier place by making it more sociable. I get a lot of satisfaction out of doing that. We began 15 years ago when my family planted uh, 15 acres of vines as a bit of a hobby. My goals for the business are ensuring that quality remains to the highest standard and we're continuing to improve it each year. Uh, the business is growing and the reputation is growing on an annual basis and looking down the line we'll be looking to expand our vineyard plantings and produce more but still keep it very boutique and very high quality.